We are in Berkeley County at the Old Santee Canal Park, and I'm speaking with Troy Deal. Troy, um, this park is open all year round for people to come, and what's the normal thing that happens when you come here? Well, it's, this park is Old Santee Canal Park. It's owned by Santee Cooper. We have 200 acres here with four miles of boardwalks and trails. Oh. Uh, it's a natural history and historical site. Um, so you can come walk through the swamp and see all kind of indigenous species or enjoy the historical significance and all the things that went on during the time period. We came to see you today because you have a special event going on called Celebrate the Season. Mm -hmm. Tell us what that is. Celebrate the Season is a month-long event. It's a one-mile driving route that starts at the Santa Cooper headquarters and ends here at the park. Um, it's actually, that's Monday through Thursday. Now, Friday, Saturday, Sunday is a special time here at the park because the whole park comes to life. We have Santa that comes and visits with us. Um, so you get out there and get in a hay wagon and it drops you off here. Oh, I bet the children love those hay rides. They love them. And um, at that point, they get off and they go a bunch of directions. We mm -hmm. have a lot to do with, for the children. We have carousels that they can ride, marshmallow pits so they can enjoy those s'mores that they bring. That's always a treat. It is a treat. Um, and the Interpreter Center. Interpreter Center is a, the big building that we have on the property. Mm -hmm. It is a winter wonderland. You walk in, all the bluff is covered with snow, uh, the lights are, the trees are lit, and the Bavarian Village is a new thing we started last year that kind of just brings a little bit of the Christmas spirit to Berkeley County. And that's where the children get to go and visit that very important figure, Santa Claus. Santa Claus, we do. We have Santa's Cabin is what we call it and uh, it is a beautiful place. Now, the community is involved because different organizations and individuals sponsor the displays, mm -hmm. although Santee Cooper, your, your people have to build them and put them together, but mm -hmm. the community participates in that way. Absolutely, yeah. One of the jobs is to go out there and get support for this big event, and, and, it, and they do. They jump right on because it's such a great opportunity for them to get involved in the community. And everything that happens here goes back to support charitable events. It does. All the proceeds that we raise goes back to the community. Now, some of the other things that happen is that you involve the school children and they come with their voices and their instruments. Tell absolutely. me about music under the stars. It's music under the stars, absolutely. We uh, have school groups from all over the county. They come and they express their talents and sing and from the bands as well. So. And then also, let's not forget about those famous artists. I think you've got some Christmas cards that are a little bit on the big side. Yeah, you don't put those in envelopes. <laughs> those, we actually give every school a, 20, a four by eight sheet of plywood, and they just come up with their own creation. And it's amazing, Amanda, to see what they come up with, their talents. And I enjoyed the sign. You've got little road signs here, and one of them says, um, Christmas cards 130 feet, right? Yeah, 130 feet, that's right. It, and we try, to get, we try to give everybody a little direction. Um, the house, which is always such a treat because it is living history to show people how they used to live. But during this season, the ladies from uh, Monk's Corner and Panopolis, the town and village garden club, come in and do something remarkable. What is it that they do? No, I mean, it's beautiful. They come in and they decorate the house with the period decor. They, they um, come out and cut vegetation here on the park. Uh, there's no indigenous, I mean, everything's indigenous. There's no native, uh, non-native species. Everything is here on the park. Well, and it really is a wonderful way to see how people used to use what was outdoors and so important to everyday life, and mm. they would bring it inside Absolutely. and make it festive for the season. Absolutely. Well, I think y'all have done a remarkable job providing a tremendous opportunity for people to get the spirit. And if people would like to know more about Celebrate the Season, what's the best way to get information? Uh, they can go to our website, which is celebrateseason.org. Well, I want to wish you and everyone here at Santee Cooper and the old Santee Canal Park a very Merry Christmas. Thank you.